hi everyone uh, we're here in my downstairs guest bathroom and um, see it's just it looks like this here um, anyhow the reason why I'm in here is I have a medicine cabinet or I guess it's like a closet and it goes all the way up there but um, I have a very disorganized medicine cabinet as you see I mean it's a mess and what I thought I would do is I went to the dollar store and I bought some containers to try to uh, reorganize this very disorganized and I thought I would show you um, what it looks like once it's complete hi everyone so I've emptied out the medicine cabinet as I would call it Excuse them, the music, my husband is uh, home and he's just relaxing and um, he wants, I don't know, he's in the backyard stuff, so uh, we're playing this kind of music, which it's okay. Um, I've separated the items, like items, in containers that I bought at the dollar store. These were a dollar each. And I'm going to organize them. Um, now that I've got them in containers, I even have some here on the bottom on the floor. But um, yeah, and then I've got all my medication stuff in here, um, you know, off, and some moisturizer stuff, shoe polish stuff that I keep down here because it's a central place. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it here, but this is where I've kept it so far. So um, if I organize my closet entry, I might change it around, but for now, that this is where I'm going to keep it. Um, I've got some hair products in here. I don't know why I have a shampoo in there. So I'm going to um, wipe down this counter, clean up top there, and um, I'll show you the end result. Hi, everyone. So I have finished organizing this medicine cabinet. As you see on the top, it's a lot more organized. This here is an emergency kit that should be going into the vehicle, which I will do later. In that basket are my ankle and knee braces and my big red first aid kit that I use for when we go on road trips or travel. So I just leave it up there. And then you can see in the inside, It looks like that. It's a lot more organized. And uh, so I have just me medicine in here. So anything miscellaneous like antihistamines, gravel, any prescription, vitamins. I even have um, like stuff for foot medication and that goes in there. And this is all pain reliever items. So, oops, anything to do like Motrin, Advil, Tylenol, um, stomach pains like Tums and Pepto. We suffer a lot of that in our house here. And so that goes there. And then here's all cold medication like Airborne. I have, well, I guess Benadryl, cold and chest congestion. I have some Vicks, Advil, cold and sinus, Neocitrin. I even have like cough drops and things like that there. And then here is uh, just a small little uh, nail kit. Um, my daughter keeps most of the nail polish, but I like to keep some spare one here if I'm in a rush to do anything. So some nail polish remover. I also have this container here and it says downstairs bathroom, do not remove. And it contains like a little manicure set. So a nail clipper, a filer, some scissors and um, I don't know what that is, probably like a cuticle remover, but I have that there. And then up here is all the dog products, so a uh, grooming bag that has all the brushes, um, an extra um, doggy bag thing, uh, just different items for my dogs and the, groom the dog grooming kit. And then these here are sprays and lotions, so body lotion after spray cream. I love this cream. Uh, this is La Roche Posay, and I got it as a sample, and what a great sample size. And it's lasted me quite a long time, but I'm almost finished with it, and I need to buy another one because I've never 
had anything that works as well as this. We have a, a pull in the back and a lot of times, um, you know, some people get like major sunburn. <laughs> And you put this on and the next day you've got a nice tan and you're completely healed. I also have, um, oops, uh, you know, just insect repellent, like off on there and uh, after bite lotion. So that is there. And a first aid kit with bandages, um, calamine lotion, neosporin, uh, bandage, cotton swabs, and then on the top I have actual jewelry cleaner and the jewelry cloth back there. I have any sort of travel size um, products I put in here, and this is just one of those dry erase containers. I tried to take off this paper and it was so difficult, so I just put the label on top. But I like how the top here just opens it up like that, so um, I kept the container. And then this basket is just shoe care items. So you see, I have like a little brush thing and any products to do with shoe care. And a sewing kit, my blood pressure monitor, and just some wipes. And I got these baskets at the dollar store and they were just a dollar. And I, if I was being picky, um, I would have loved for them all to be the same color, the handles. But I, I took all the white ones they had, and they were multi, they had different colors. But I wanted the white ones, and unfortunately, the handles were all different colors. So I just had to let it be. But that's it. Uh, much more organized, and I'm really pleased at how it turned out. So um, I'm hoping I spelt all the labels right. <laughs> I'm a poor speller, so uh, anyhow. Um, I'm really happy. It didn't take that long to do, but now I can find everything. So thank you guys for watching. Hopefully this has inspired you guys. If your medicine cabinet is disorganized, uh, take a minute and uh, organize it. You'll feel better. Uh, the other thing I might want to do is um, I might hang up some like um, items here. I wouldn't mind having like a brush and comb here too. Um, have just in case this is in the bathroom is downstairs so if we leave this is where we end up um, going you know to touch up quickly before we leave the house or whatever so I might add a brush and comb set in there so thank you you guys for watching take care bye